This is America. We have the founding fathers that wrote the Constitution that we haven't lived by in 142 years. Hello, everybody. How you doing? Hope everybody's doing fine. Really do. You know, I got some. I guess you could call it breaking news. Uh, in my personal opinion, it's something that not just me should do, but some more people should do as well. This morning I was on my way to work and me and Dutch were talking and the subject come up about volcanoes and earthquakes and you know we were talking about the situation and everything that's been going on and he said you know it seems a lot like 2011 and you know it just dawned on me right off the bat. I said, Dutch, since I'm on the way to work, I says, run a search on CERNs. Well, guess what? On March 11, 2011. You're not going to believe it. You're not going to believe it. 2011 CERNs was operating yes it was now why am I coming to this conclusion now I'm not saying that this is what occurred I understand me I'm saying this is what occurred this is my theory now we were all talking all kinds of different things about what caused you know the Fukushima disaster right now let's think about this a minute 17 mile circle okay now I'm sure that the North and the South Pole are you know quite a bit bigger in diameter as that than that I ain't quite sure cause couldn't find no information on it <clears throat> but let's think about it they're in Sweden off to the side of the planet of the North and the South Pole you're creating another magnetic field on the planet it's round right and where my finger is up here my finger my thumbs are joined there is the north and the south pole but over here but over here is where CERN's is now y'all know when you get the the halos coming, you know, the magnetic field coming like this and going to the north and it comes in and it goes into the south. Well, what's happening when CERNs is running? Is it doing this? Get my drift? Because you're creating a massive magnetic field, aren't you? You sure are. Now, you know, it don't take a brain scientist or a scientist at all to understand that our energy comes from the sun to start with, doesn't it? That's why we get those halos around from the north to the south pole and we get, you know, the electric universe going on with all the electric lights and all that. Well, my theory is this. Is since all of this has happened, in 
concerns shut down and quit. They're running it again, aren't they? What's happened lately? Number one, when they first fired it up and they had a problem, we lost a plane, didn't we? Sure did. Now, let's think about that a minute. They got that problem fixed. They had no more planes go down. But what have we had a lot of lately? Lately. Bunches of earthquakes. Bunch of movement. Volcanoes. Earthquakes. Hmm. Am I saying they're larger than normal? No. Am I saying they're different than normal? No. But isn't it quite odd that we have all of this magma moving as well for volcanoes? Even one, uh, what is it, west of California and the ocean that went off? Now let's see. We got all of that going on. And their main agenda is to see what's in the universe and where God is and who God is. And can we recreate God's invention? Or is it just plain time travel? Or jump to a second dimension of whatever reason? In the background here, the light stays at a certain pace and I can do it you're gonna see a chart you're gonna to have to go to the web page to actually see it good uh, because I'm gonna be in the video but in this chart I want you to have an opinion of your own and explain to me why CERNs has put some information up there and they put these up in red which are holidays hmm. but now they're not the religious type now are they I don't know folks it's a damn shame that they're doing the things that they're doing to start with and it's very in my opinion and trust me I'm not no scientist I just know that if you was to take a round ball a metal round ball and you put a magnet above and below from the north and the south pole and then you put one off to the side you're going to pull something away You're going to have three or something. You're going to have a north and a south, or a north, south, and east. You're going to have a, kind of like a, well, how am I going to do this for you? Well, have something like that. See? Now, are they trying to talk to second dimensions? Is there a such thing? There may be. Is it possible that they should be trying to do that? <clears throat> you know, there was a, a movie or a TV series that was out. It was called Fringe. I used to watch it all the time. And you know... They had a second dimension in that movie. And they were trying to keep from the two dimensions becoming one. So where they got the idea from a movie? No, it was way a long time before that movie come out or that TV series that they've been doing this. 
So what am I saying? I'm saying that all of you, to all of you, no matter what you think it may be, you can be assured that it's not for the reasons that you think it is. Could it be a massive weapon? Could it be time travel? Could it be a second dimension? Could it be I don't know. I gave you three. It's y'all's turn to give some more. But whatever they're doing with it, it has killed people. Now for the second time, in my opinion. Now, this is where we go back into this what are we going to do about it? How can we fix it? Well, one way and the main way is to wake up your fellow man. That's the first thing you've got to do. Everyone got to know that they belong they belong they're not free they belong to the new world order democracy I showed you a video yesterday where the people and I said 54 but it was 1950 it started and went to 61 of the way the area that I live in looked like. The people were happy, free, freer. Not entirely, completely free, no. But they had more freedoms then than we do now. When Kennedy got shot, they knew right then that they could get away with that they could get away with anything and they have 9-11 and told you it was Bin Laden and Bin Laden died where somewhere around what 2001 it was reported on national news If we, the people, don't stick up for each other and help one another and design a platform for us to speak on in a massive way, because we can't vote, it's rigged. We got to do it another way. We got to come up with a solution to fix these problems. And we got to do it now. Before they do this experiment and keep doing it, and they find out that they got the biggest, nastiest weapon in the world, or it opens another second dimension and the world starts colliding with this other second dimension and could destroy us all both dimensions or they create a wormhole of some sort and they bring aliens through it of a bad species of whatever the reason may be or who or what they just don't like human life and the way we created or the way we believe in human life. It's all up to you folks. And it's all up to your thoughts. 
Now, it's entirely up to y'all. We can sit here and twiddle our thumbs and just let them do whatever they want to, anytime they want to, and never say a word. Just go to work, be a good little boy, and don't say nothing to anybody because they telling you to jump through a damn hoop. Don't never say nothing to nobody. Don't have an opinion. Just do your job, suck it up, and just do whatever, and let them treat you any way you want. Like in Missouri at AT&T, they want you to sign your life away by giving all your passwords. What's next? Your driver's license, they already get that. They get your social security number. What else can they do? Your credit card numbers too, in case you do something, they can steal your money from you. That's coming if it ain't already happened. From my cold dead hands, abolish corporate government for your freedoms, and this is damn well why. Do you want to be free, or you want them to destroy you some way or another? Much love. Y'all have a good day now, you hear? Don't forget to follow Tattoo1009.com on Facebook and Twitter and YouTube and to handle emotion and stumble upon. Please help spread the word by sharing our articles on your favorite social networks. Go to the links in the below section for updates every day. From my cold dead hands abolish the corporate government.